guys to a new video today we're gonna basket the old birds for a short distance race we will basket 10 birds for this one maybe they will be released tomorrow that's friday but because the weather is not that great i think it will be saturday so i will uh, put two birds on with a gps wing but i put a timer on saturday so i hope they will be released on saturday then we uh, Maybe have some uh, GPS tracks of a ways, so we will see it then. Yesterday we also um, did bring the young birds to a training. We also used the GPS wings, so I'll show you that as well. And um, for now I will clean the other part of the loft and then uh, we're gonna feed the birds. Here we have the GPS tracks of the young birds from last Wednesday. We released them near Swollen. We also did it with the old birds, and you can see with the young birds they took another line than the old birds. These lines blue and red, both of uh, the young birds. But you can see they choose the line different, but maybe it's because we also released the birds like around somewhere here that they did take that line back to home. So yeah, maybe that's, that's the reason why they uh, took that line. So this is uh, from the young birds. Saturday, if everything went well, we also have a track of the old birds from a race. So we will uh, see that one in the next video. We have the youngsters outside. This one already came in. We cleaned the floor. We leave this just the way it is. But tomorrow we're gonna basket the young birds for the first race of the season. And now it's for real. So we put the chips on this week. So when they uh, walk over the system, we can register the young birds. So we will have 20 young birds in the race for Saturday. So today is the last training. Tomorrow they won't go outside. And we're only gonna feed them 10 grams in the morning and then we're gonna basket them tomorrow evening it's a race about 120 kilometers around that so not that long but it's um, the first time that they go with the department it will be a full release of the whole department the other the training one was just in, in groups, so it's the first time they will uh, be released with the whole department. So it will be uh, a lot of pigeons, they think around 20,000 young birds for the first race, so uh, we will see. So this evening we're gonna basket the old birds. And that will be 10 of course. And we also have one pair still with eggs that are those on the white with that hen but we're gonna put the eggs in a breeding chamber so they will uh, stay warm that pair got two youngsters so those youngsters will be around 10 days old for the Helmstead flight or race that we have on 20 July and the thing is that I want to basket 10 birds for that race so with this short distance race I hope they all come back we are also gonna use the GPS wings for this short distance race so I hope the race will be on Saturday and not tomorrow like what the department wants to plan but it's gonna be a lot of rain tomorrow, so I don't think uh, they will be released. So I put the GPS wings on Saturday, and then we will see. I hope uh, they will be released on Saturday and not tomorrow, but also because I have to work, of course. So I won't see the birds coming home, but yeah, it's all old, old birds, so they um, will find their way in. But it's. Uh, more likely to watch the birds when they arrive. That's why we have pigeons to see them come coming home. So I already put uh, food with the young birds. 
so when they are coming in they can eat and then tomorrow they will get around 10 grams so they have something with them for the waste i don't want to uh, waste them on hunger so that's why i'm just feeding them in the morning as well for today they will uh, get a lot more than usual so that they have enough for the waste for tomorrow so or for, for saturday i mean so Guys, we got a basket for the old birds, so we're gonna get them and then we will uh, basket the birds at the club for the short distance race. Here we have the baskets, so we're gonna get the pigeons. These two eggs I laid in the breeding chamber and I put a fake egg underneath them so when they arrive they have eggs and then later on I will put uh, their own eggs back. So. Here we have the first one, 915. She will also get the GPS ring on. Also her male of her partner also. That's this one, 909. So we will see if the birds get released on Saturday what the GPS tracks uh, will show us. I put them on 8 o'clock in the morning for Saturday. So I hope uh, they will release them on Saturday. Here we have another hen, 976. <coughs> She's already on seven old flights. So she won't get all the races, I think, but we will see. Here we have another hen, 173. The last one, 401. The hands, of course. She's already on eight old flights, so it's already going past the mold. So we have all the birds, nine. The other male bird that's right there. We'll just leave him at home for one week, and then next week he will go on Helmstead, the German race. So that also was the video. I hope you liked it. Please give a thumbs up or subscribe to my channel. You can do it down below. I would appreciate it. See you on the next one. Bye guys.